he was just like, you know, you from here, you know, you be in this area, you know, maybe we can hang out. Y'all, he gave me his number and everything. welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is angel so y'all today is monday i just got up um i had some things on my agenda today and i do have a few more things that i need to get done um i just left the mall because i didn't do one extra thing i was supposed to do one more thing i thought girl y'all i literally have to write everything down because if i don't i'll forget it oh that's what i'm supposed to do so I still got to go to one more store and I also got to go to CVS. So I'll just take you guys with me uh, when I go into those stores. But anyways, y'all, I just got back home. Um, I just running some quick little errands, y'all, this Monday morning. I just finished um, online with my kids and everything like that. So I am done for the day as far as my job. So like I was saying, y'all, my job actually sent like a questionnaire asking who wanted to work um, for the summer 2021. Um, I filled it out. I don't know how I really feel about it. Um, depending on what I'll be doing, um, I really don't mind. I mean, who want, who don't want to make extra money, sis? Like, who don't want to make extra money? Point them out. Show them to me. Because we get this money over here. Period. Okay? So, anyways. <laughs> let me show y'all what I got real quick. Um, I can show y'all these first. because I literally just picked this up from JCPenney's. I took it out the box. If you love Carry Care hair products, um, normally I go to like my local beauty supply store like Beauty and Beyond or those types of stores, um, but they're kind of overpriced. So I always go to um, JCPenney's. I always get like my shampoo for like $6, my conditioner for about like $9 or something like that. I mean, the prices may not be, they may be kind of the same, but you know. I picked this up from JCPenney's. It's just the um, Hamecto cream conditioner i love carry care this is what i use on my hair um it makes my hair super silky super soft super moisturized so this is my jeweler i had a lot of people to ask me um who's my jeweler who do i go to um to get my jewelry from um and all of that stuff especially my gold jewelry so yeah they bought all my silver stuff y'all but you know for gold jewelry like this is the jewel right here for my gold jewelry so I went in there today, y'all, and I picked up um, this rope chain, and y'all see it? It's so cute. It's gold, and this is going to be an anklet. Basically, it's an anklet. I'm actually going to put it on now real quick. It's just a gold anklet. I already have one for my um, left leg. I just needed one for my right leg. I couldn't decide, so he ended up giving me a really, really good deal on both of these. And then I just got this silver one. Um, this is not a Cuban. This is called a Figaro chain. So I'm not sure if it's going to focus or not. But um, basically, if you guys are familiar with jewelry, this is kind of like a Cuban, um, but it's not. Um, super cute. I don't have any Figaro chains in my collection. Um, so I was like, you know what? Let's get something different. Because I do have Cubans and all of the other stuff. But I was like, let's get a Figaro chain. So Sips By also sent me something. I have been working with them um, for a minute. I have been on their um, PR list for I don't know how long, you guys. They send me some really, really good teas. I feel like I've been drinking a lot of tea um, versus coffee. But that coffee that I had in my last vlog, you guys, I really enjoyed it. Like, it was so good. But I didn't have any trouble getting up this morning, so I really didn't need it. So, they sent me the Yogi um, Raspberry Perfect Energy Tea. This is for, um, it's going to give you energy and focus support. So, I need that. Because sometimes my teacher span, you guys, is very short. Like, very short. And then I got some Stash White Peach Tea. They sent me some, ooh, this one is nice. Organic India. This is um, Tulsi Breakfast Tea. It is stress relieving and awakening. Now that is going to be perfect for like time to wind down, sis. So I just have some orange ginger mint tea. If y'all hear something in the background, Kaysen is online with his school and now Kaysen's phone is ringing. So yeah, they sent me some really good teas last month. I forgot to show you guys. Like I had vanilla caramel tea and it was so good, y'all. Like if you like teas and want to be sent like tea subscriptions, you know. Tips by 
is your go-to. I think y'all already know what this is, honestly, y'all. Oh, so this is the waxing kit by Tress Wellness. So y'all stay tuned for this. Stay tuned for this. So before I forget, this is what they look like. This one right here, you guys, is actually called a palm chain. I love this one. It is super thick, like she thick, okay? This one is really, really nice. And then this is my new one. I actually got this one last summer, 2020. And then um, this is the um, new one that I have, and this is just a solid rope chain. Somebody tell me no. I have been looking at this bag since last night. This is the Gucci Marmont Metalise bag. I was also looking on YouTube, you guys, at so many different ways to wear this bag. It could be worn as a shoulder bag, a crossbody bag, a belt bag, a clutch. Oh my gosh, y'all. I think this is perfect for when I go shopping, when I don't have a super big bag. This is perfect for going out. This is just, it's not too fancy. It's so classic, but it can be dressed up or it can be dressed down with some jeans. Y'all, I want this freaking bag so bad. And it actually has a nice amount of space in it. I really want this bag, y'all. And it also comes, oh, y'all, look at the heart on the bag. Oh, my gosh, y'all. And see, she's just wearing it as a regular shoulder bag. And um, this will be my first Gucci purchase, you guys. Uh, Babe and I are actually going to um, Georgia this weekend. So I'm thinking about actually going into store to get the full experience. But I don't know, y'all. Y'all, I'm getting ready to have my lunch and watch some Peyton. She just uploaded this vlog yesterday, so I'm going to go ahead and watch her. And then after that, I do have like a little um, work to do for my job, so I'm going to do that next. But let me show y'all my lunch, because I fixed her up, okay? So this is just what I'm having for lunch. Um, Just some chili that my dad made, some homemade chili. Put some cheese, and then I just topped it off with some crackers. Y'all, it's so freaking hot. Ah! And I said it on my leg. Oh my God. Yo, what's up you guys? So today is Wednesday. No, it's not. I lied. <laughs> today is Tuesday, y'all. I just finished filming um, this makeup look. It is super pretty. Um, you guys probably won't see this from like a week from now. I'm really just trying to get content like film, get it going, get it ready. Um, so that I can just push it out there when I need it. Oh, because vlogs are so simple, y'all. Vlogs are so much easier to just edit and all of that good stuff. I'm about to try on some um, shoes for y'all. Some shoes that I've hauled um, over the past maybe like two weeks or so. Like I would just say some spring slash summer shoes. Summer shoes. Summer shoes <laughs> that you guys can expect to see me in, um, hopefully on Instagram. Y'all, I really got to be more active on Instagram. I'm actually getting ready to take a picture now. Um, like, my creative juices when it comes to Instagram, uh, what, what is that? Kaysen got his car underneath the fireplace. But, um, yeah, like, Instagram, ooh. I love YouTube, like I love video. Anything with some video, like my story, um, Snapchat, I love me some videos. But pictures, I'm not a big like picture taker type person. But anyways, um, I guess I'll try on these shoes real quick. I do have a few pairs, y'all, that I literally just ordered, but I'm gonna take to Play-Doh's Closet because, um, I mean, why not? I can get the money back from them. Um, not all of it, of course, but something. Because some of them are like too tight or something like that. I'll show y'all those too. Um, it's lunchtime. I need to be eating some lunch. I was actually going to go to my dad's house. But he's not answering the phone. I don't want to drive all the way over there. And then he's not there. Because I want to go visit him. Babe and I visited him Saturday. Yeah, we just chilled. And it was so funny y'all. Because like him and Babe, like they were just talking about cars the whole time. And I'm just sitting here like, really? <sighs> Men. But anyways, let me go ahead and um, show y'all these shoes real quick. Try to take a picture and see what we're going to eat for lunch because I'm starving. Ooh, y'all, I got some cute pictures. Oh, my God. I 
I think. I done took like a hundred pictures, y'all. But I think I got some cute ones. I should really probably start taking my pictures like on my camera and stuff. But I just rather do it off my phone because I'm lazy. And using my camera, it's too much work. That was so terrible of me to say that, but it really is. I gotta be honest. So these are the first pair. These are super freaking cute. I love these, you guys. I have been looking for like a white pair of heels, um, especially something that's still kind of trendy. So I love that it has the clear strap across the front of the foot. Um, I love the double straps across the ankle. I love the chunky heel that it has. Like, it's so 80s, so 90s. These are just super freaking cute. Oh, my gosh, y'all. And, y'all, these are actually super duper comfortable, by the way, too. Like, these are really, really comfortable. And these are actually a seven and a half. I normally wear eight, but when I tried these on, I still also have, like, a lot of room at the foot. Um, and, you know, with shoes like this, especially clear shoes, y'all know sometimes your feet slide. So, um, I think the seven and a half fits literally perfect. These are the next pair. Oops, they're backwards. These are the next pair, you guys. If y'all follow me on Snap, you saw me wear these in Miami. They actually have these in silver as well. Um, I'm definitely going to go back and get the silver ones. And they're super comfortable. Like, these are just too cute. Like, really, really cute. I really love these. So, y'all don't have to forgive me. It is so hard to put my own heels on, y'all, especially when Babe is not here. Um, these are so cute. These are just some nude heels, and they have the clear strap going across the front. I love these, you guys. Um, I probably could have went down a half size, honestly, but um, it's, it's not, you know, it's nothing too crazy. But these are really, really cute. I know they're not strapped up right and all of that, but y'all get my drift. <laughs> But these are really, really cute. These are the next ones. These are just some super cute black sandal heels. They also have these in white. But since I found the first pair that I just showed you guys, I was getting ready to order these, y'all. But I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and just get one pair and be good. Because y'all know I be acting up. Like, y'all know. I'm a shopaholic. I love to shop. And I love fashion, and I love to dress and all of that good stuff. But, yeah, these are so cute. Um, and they're super comfortable. Nice, chunky heel on them. So, this is the last pair of shoes I'm going to show you guys. These are super cute. They're just some rhinestone sandals. Um, they're uh, exactly like the other ones, um, but they have the full rhinestone strap going across the front. Super cute. They have that dark um, brown bottom on them. These are really cute. Hopefully y'all can see because this sun is going crazy, crazy.
hot as hell out here. Me and Kason, we just had some Chick fil A not too long ago. Let me, oh, he's showing y'all his cup. Let me tell y'all about Kason. Or let me tell y'all what just happened, rather. We actually head to my dad's house so we can spend a few hours with him. Let me tell y'all about Kason. So, y'all, this kid, oh my God. So, I had kept seeing this truck like circle around me a few times. Hopefully, y'all can hear me because the air going. Um, but I saw a truck keep circling around me and I was like, what is going on? Like, what's his deal? So, um, I was like, um, okay. So, when I came back to the car, y'all, the man, he was like, oh, oh, I waited on you to come out the store. He was like, I've been waiting on you. I was like, what? And it's so crazy, y'all, because <laughs> he was just like, you know, you from here, you know, you be in this area, you know, maybe we can hang out. Y'all, he gave me his number and everything, like, you know, I was like, okay. Um, and I can't lie, sis, he was fine as hell. <laughs> I can't even cap. I can't even lie. But y'all know. I won't tell me your part. Y'all know I'm trying to do right and I'm in a relationship. So, you know. But y'all, it was so crazy because like earlier today, like before I did my makeup and stuff, even though nobody can't even see you anyway, um, I got hit on the mall. Like it's been crazy, y'all. Like I don't it don't even matter. Get over. Shit. But anyways, y'all, like, it don't matter if I have on makeup or not. Like, they still be trying to bite down. You know what I'm saying? They still be trying to step down. But, anyways, um, what was I about to say? Y'all, Kaysen done ratted me out. As soon as that happened, the guy, he was like, let me take your mask down. Let me see your face or whatever. Y'all, as soon as that happened, here go Kaysen tell my son, I'm about to call my daddy. And uh, he, he calls on um, Glenn and Dad sometimes, y'all. So... Um, he was like, I'm about to call my daddy, and he was like, um, I'm telling on you. So he literally got his phone, called Glenn, y'all, and I called him for him because I'm like, I was gonna tell him anyway. And then he come Glenn, like, was you gonna tell me about this? Like, I was telling him if I were to tell you about every time somebody hit on me and tried to talk to me, like, no, you'll part. get sick of hearing that, no, okay? Not your part, it's my part. But the way he waited yeah, around and shit, like, part. that was, like, crazy. So I did kind of tell him that. That was kind of cute, though. It was cute. Mm -hmm. um, but still creepy to so me a little bit. Say my, my part, mama. Okay, baby. So, yeah. So, Kason was, like, um, he called um, Glenn or whatever. He didn't answer, so he finally called us back. Oh, my God, my camera's dying. All right, so he finally called us back and everything, y'all. And he was just telling him what happened. Was like, my mama got a, a dude number. Try to get her number, and he she trying to talk to a dude, and he got her number. Tell him what you were saying. All right. So first, I said <laughs> I'm not te te keeping secrets from my dad. Yes, he told he told me y'all come out. I'm getting ready to call my daddy because I'm not keeping no secrets from my daddy. I'm like really. Y'all, Casey read me straight all the way out. And what else? My, he his son. Y'all, well, Kason is. Live with my dad. Oh, really? Well, we all live together. Kason loves Glenn, y'all. He is obsessed with that man. But then when he got on the phone, y'all, Kason rats me out again. And then he says that I gave him my number. No, he gave me his number. And not only that, and then he talking about um, what else you said to my son? You should have told him you had a boyfriend. I'm like, whose side are you on? And Pick a side and stay there. Period. Who side are you on? I don't know what you and um Mr. Glenn got no, no, going no, on. No, 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 no. Be safe. Oh, be okay. Safe well, like, My granddaddy, yeah, he not even at home. Guys, I just made it back home. My camera died while I was trying to tell you guys, finish telling you guys the story. Um, y'all. I've got to do better. I really do. I'm gonna show y'all what I got, of course. But um, what was I about to say? I need to put y'all on my tripod because I got y'all sitting on the case of books. Hold on. But yeah, like I was saying, y'all. Like, uh, let me go ahead and put a disclaimer out there. Um, I am in a relationship, a committed relationship, a serious relationship, a exclusive relationship, sis. How we want to word it? I am still human. 
I clearly have eyes to see. And, you know, like, don't take stuff so serious. I know y'all don't either, but sometimes I just feel like I have to, like, like, some people that I know watch my vlogs, I have to, I feel like I have to say that for. If that makes sense. But I know, like, I'm a fun person. Y'all know I love to joke. I love to have fun and stuff like that. But just because I'm in a relationship does not mean that I'm blind and I can't see. Just like, let me see who this is, y'all. <sighs> Hold on one more time, y'all. And with that being said, like, for those of you that are married out there or in relationships, like, on a more serious tip, um, your man got eyes, sis. Just like you got eyes. You know what I mean? Like, and then some people take stuff too literal anyway. Like, if I saw somebody that's fine, I'd be like, dang, they fine. And, you know, I mean, like, who cares? Like, if my man see a girl with a big butt, like, I may even be like, damn, she got a big butt. I may even point it out. You know what I mean? So, I don't, we don't take stuff, like, my relationship with my man sis is very fun. Like, we take things that need to be taken serious and stuff that's, you know, like it's not that deep we don't take it that deep you know what i mean all right anyways enough of that because i don't like explaining myself for real for real y'all and i don't like to um have to give reason or have to worry about anybody else's feelings or if they feel some type of way about what i said or what i did okay okay but y'all case and rated me all the way out i was just like pick a side what's good pick a side and stay there but he loved his dad, y'all. He loved his daddy. Oh, so let me show y'all what I got today. Because I went kind of crazy, okay? So we'll start with the um store that I just came out of. I don't, I'm not in the mood to try on anything else. Like, I need to be editing this vlog. I need to be folding clothes up. I need to be getting ready for dinner. It's Tuesday. Baby's coming home. And um, I'm sure he wants some hot food. So, yeah. I'm just going to show y'all. And then guess what? What I'll do for y'all in my next vlog, I'll do another shoe try on haul. Like a little shoe, a spring shoe segment or something like that. We'll figure it out. But super cute, super cute. They're just these, just these, dang I can't talk. Just these cute um, black heels with some little straps at the top. I love that these are super sexy, um, super simple. Love it. They had these, as you guys saw um, when I was in the store, they had these in nude, they had these in gold, they had these in silver, um, they had these in black, every color. Cause I was literally about to order another pair of these strappy nude shoes that I showed you guys um, earlier this morning. I was gonna um, order a black pair, but for $10, y'all, everything in that store is $10. So I'm probably about to put these on and wear these around the house, tiptoe around the house to see what they're like on. Um, because I couldn't try anything on like as far as the clothes in the store so more than likely sometimes I do have to take something back some stuff back so I picked up this cute black dress it's super cute it has some buttons down it hopefully I don't have to take this one back it's more like a um a midi dress and I like that I got a small because I wanted to be tight it's really thick really good material they had it in white too but I was just like be good because I just had on a white dress earlier today and that was $10 so I was like, I'm gonna get that. And what else did I get? So not everything is $10, majority of the stuff is $10. And then I picked up this uh, white t-shirt. It's got like a pocket on it. Um, it's $6, this was $6. I got this in a size small. I feel like you cannot go wrong with these type of shirts. Tucked inside some jeans, a cute belt, um, some cute heels, um, sandals, you know, whatever folks show about. And I could not pass up on this top. This is just a mocha color top. I feel like the browns are really in. And then I, this was on sale for, well, it was $7. And I picked up these sunglasses. I'm not sure how I feel about them because I really couldn't see them in the store. Um, because the mirrors were so high. Y'all, I'm only like 5'1". Like, I'm super short. But, like, I thought these were cute. I thought these were giving. Let me tuck this in real quick. I hope this stuff is not real sticky to the freaking sunglasses. I got some goo, goo gone, so it will probably get it off. I don't have any frames like this. These are definitely giving me Versace vibes. Y'all see um, how they looking. Damn, these are cute. And these were only $6. I'm glad I got them because I was like, those look kind of dope. Whoa. 
these are really pretty i just gotta take that um white tag off of them girl them cute i'm real cute and then i got this white skirt this was ten dollars uh i definitely gonna have to try this on y'all because i am i like skirts but i like more like a fitted or bandage skirts not denim skirts because like they like stick out at the back because of my butt uh but we're gonna try it on we're gonna try it on and see how they go in just a second and then i went into um good old city trends wait a minute i was supposed to take this back to city trends and look at casey y'all and then i can't believe you ratted me out like that but um the shoes that i showed you guys earlier um the silver ones the silver slides they were actually too small i'm actually going to take those to play those closet so i just picked up another pair of these these are so freaking cute um i got them in a um i got them in the silver color so i already had like the golden um champagne rose gold color hold on one second and now i have them in the um the silver color and the last item that i picked up from rainbow was this denim bustier this is so freaking cute i have been looking for this bustier for like uh a few weeks now i was gonna order it off the website but i finally went into the store this morning something told me to go in that exact location and i went right in and i found it it is so cute with some jeans or some white jeans some black jeans i just love denim 